Hello YouTube and Facebook. This is Set Free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. This is all the godly messages that Jesus Christ has given me to share with people on Facebook and YouTube. So this is Set Free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. This is all the godly messages God has given to me. Set Free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. So welcome to Set Free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. This is all the godly messages that God has given me to share. So let me let me pull them up. Let me go to all these godly messages that God has given me. Okay, here we go. Set Free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. Here we go. I'm going to share this quick testimony. Jesus Christ delivered me from the pit of pornography. Psalms 103, verse 10. Jesus Christ delivered me from the pit of pornography. He delivered me. Bye bye. God bless you. Set free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. I'm just taking you through a list of all the things God has given me. And I'm going so you can see. Set free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. So let me find it. What's up, YouTube? I'm on here to talk to, to speak to the deceived woman, the woman that does not have a relationship with Christ, the woman that's being deceived from God's truth. I'm on here to speak to the deceived woman who's doing her, who's doing herself in with her own lips. I'm on this YouTube to speak to the, the, the deceived woman, the woman that's being deceived by the devil from God's truth. The woman that's doing herself in with her own lips. She can't see what she's saying that she's doing her own. I'm on here to speak to the deceived woman. The woman that's being deceived by the devil. That's doing herself in with her own words. And I'm praying that God deliver her. Revelation 12, 9. It says the devil is deceiving this whole world. Revelation 12, 9. Bye-bye. God bless Set free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. That's what I am going to. Set free from the Trap Ministry Chronicles. Yep, that's what I'm headed to. Hello YouTube and Facebook. I'm on here to share the reason why I follow Christ. It has nothing to do with religion. Religion is not Jesus. That's not Jesus. He came so we can have a relationship with him. And it's a faith walk. There's a reason why I'm on YouTube, why I'm on Facebook sharing this. And I want to share from the Bible why I'm putting hope in Jesus Christ. 
why I'm putting faith in Jesus Christ. And I got to share this in love, why I'm following Christ. Before I share the scripture, I want to share something. The reason why I'm following Christ is because once upon a time, I was hopeless. I had no hope. I was at the end. I didn't know when I was growing up, and I didn't know back in 2002, and I did not know that you could have a relationship with Christ. I was caught up in sin, living the way I want till it came to an end. The Bible says that sin has pleasure for a season. I didn't know that then. And when it came to an end, that's when I called out to Jesus. And the reason why I'm in the body of Christ, why I'm in the church, why I'm on here sharing God's truth, because I'm praying someone else on Facebook and YouTube will see how God changed me. And he met me, he met me, he met me uh, in a hopeless moment. When I didn't know where, I didn't know where to turn to. I had no clue where to turn to. And I know that somebody was given an altar call on the radio by coming to Christ. And uh, they ministered through the radio. The pastor was preaching through the radio. And that's where the Holy Spirit of God, God started to talk to me. And it didn't happen overnight. But the reason why I'm in the body of Christ, because when I called out to Jesus, he came to my rescue. He changed me. It didn't happen overnight. And he's still, he's still, he's, he's still here with me. So the, 